Because of 17 years of Swiss Nazi terror, my mind automatically tries to defend me from more of it and entirely blocks out the continents of their terror mail. So I didn't see it at first, but when I showed the video to someone while looking on the, at the screen, it got another dimension. And then I saw it. Above the logo of the Swiss bear of the Swiss authorities, there is a crown over it. That means none other that the aristocracy is ruling. As the Templars who founded Switzerland in 1291 are of aristocratic descent indeed. Switzerland is not a monarchy and never was. And they constantly brag about their direct democracy and all the privileges they have compared to the rest of the world. So why is there a royal crown on the key positions ruling the country, if it was a people's republic? Well, Switzerland is so mixed with the nobility through the Prime Noctus, or First Right, see my other videos about that, that all Swiss have the pharaonic gene, like recently genetically analysed. Switzerland is, in fact, that pharaonic breeding ground and the royal nest, where all royals come and study like in Geneva, a Swiss international school or a Swiss elite boarding school. And by the way, this is Pharaoh's immaculate conception, spreading the royal bloodline through the Prime Noctus and then immaculately liberating the young girl in the morning after a perfectly clean immaculate bath washed and tidied her clothes and an, an immaculate royal breakfast thus immaculately returning to her newly wed husband just like the entire immaculate clean and neutral Switzerland with their nobility's crown over the bear in that unholy, evil alliance of the crown with the bear standing for European. Thus apprehending Pharaoh's disgust, like doing the prime noctus with that European bitch smelling like a bear, before kicking the bear out with an immaculate aura around her and inside her, as if nothing really ever happened at all, just an immaculate return from the castle. Here you can see the two lions, the symbol of the the, uh, the, 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 the nobility and the pharaonic uh, royal dignity of the pharaohs with the crown. <laughs> this is the aristocracy ruling. Right? Here it says 17, 70. And here you can see pharaohs, knights of the aristocracy. It's still the, 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 it's still the same lineage. Nothing has changed, you know. That's why there's a crown overhead. These are the ones, you know, like lying things together to put me in prison, who have terrorized me for 17 years, who make murder threats. They are the knights of the Middle Ages, you know. Nothing has changed. Nothing has changed. It's the same pharaonic lineage. And they are, they are not full-blooded full, full -blooded pharaohs, these ones here, otherwise they would be the king. But they have a very large percentage, more than the average people. The crown of Switzerland. Islamic State is not the enemy. But that is the enemy, the Royal Templars of Octogon, Switzerland. Immaculate Switzerland and the Swiss crown rule the world.